Hi, I'm Debbie Avu. Welcome to this segment of my two minute tips on acrylic painting techniques. So I'm an art teacher and I get asked a ton of questions about acrylic painting. So I'm going to be going over my most frequently asked questions in two minutes. Today's segment is on texture. How do I get texture with my acrylic paint? So let's start the timer. Here we go. All right, so what I would recommend is save your old brushes. These are perfect for getting lots of great texture. Or you can also buy really cheap brushes and just mash them up so they're all messed up because that is great texture. Home Depot also has really cheap brushes that, you know, they're, they have like frayed edges on them and they're, they're great. They're the little chip brushes you get in the paint section. I love those. I get, I use those a lot for lots of texture. I use that on this Seaside Post design that I did and those brushes, they're just, they're my favorite. Um, so you're just going to tap. You're just going to smash your brush down and just lightly, lightly tap on the canvas. Don't smear it around. Don't smudge it because then you're going to get a blending technique. You also want to make sure that you get the, keep the brushes really dry. You don't want them wet. If the paint is wet and the brush is wet, it's going to soften up the texture and be more of a soft blended look and you don't want that. If you're going for kind of a rough texture look, you can use this for painting rocks. You can do this for giving like a, a mossy look on trees, same technique, and you're just going to layer up. If you're doing moss, you want to start with a darker color first and gradually build up lighter and lighter and lighter. Same thing if you're doing um, texture on a rock. You want to usually start with the darker color first and then you're going to build up to the light colors. To get a soft fluffy texture like fur from a, on a kitten or an animal fur, you want to use a bit of a wider brush, not a skinny pointy brush, one that has like a little bit of width to it. And you're going to add a little bit of water and you're just going to brush down and sort of flick your wrist up so you get just a soft wispy end to the fur. And that's going to really give you that soft, soft look. With scumbling, you're just going to dip a little bit of paint on your brush. Overall, you want it pretty dry. So you're going to smash your brush down on the canvas and you're just smearing, just smudging, keeping contact with the canvas and just smudging, smudging, smudging until all of the paint is basically off your brush. And you want to try to keep those edges nice and soft and that's going to give you a very soft, cloudy look. Time's up. Okay, we did it. Two minutes. All right, thank you so much for watching. I hope you got a little something out of that. If you did, I would appreciate a thumbs up so much. Have a great day.